Hi, this is Roger from Kanker Labs, and I think I noticed a little accuracy problem with the 121 GWEV block multimeter uh, in the highest resistance range. And I found this uh, because we check all values of our RLC boxes. Um, and when we go here to the range above 1 mega ohm, I uh, first of all connected my trustworthy XTEC 570A. And the resistors here um, have 1% accuracy, and you know that they are usually more accurate. So let's start with 2.7 MAC, 3.3 MAC, and you can see they are consistently more accurate than 1%. 3.9 MAC, 4.7, 5.6, 6.7, 4.7 and now of course the range changes because uh, the multimeter has 50,000 counts just as the uh, EV block 121GW. Now we are at 5.6. Remember this 5.606 so it's quite near to the exact value. Then comes 6.8 MAC. And you see the resistors are nearly spot on and uh, the accuracy here in, in the resistance range is very good. So we can trust the, the, the displayed values. 8.2 MEG. So there we have uh, the largest deviation until now. And finally 10 MEG. And here we are at uh, half a percent one third of a percent off. Now let's exchange this with the 121GW. Firmware is 2.0 for those of you who want to know and at 2. Point, I just have to check if the, uh, the switch is for the filters are in the middle position so that resistance is really isolated from capacitance and inductance. So 2.7, okay. 3.3 MEG, okay. 3.9 MEG, okay. 4.7 is also okay. You can see that at these high resistance values it takes some time until the, the final value stabilizes. Now comes the range switch just as in the XTEC and now we have 5.65 so the display is 1% off compared to the XTEC and this would be already slightly, well it would be just 1% accuracy of the resistor if this display value is constant is um, really true. Also the 6.8 MAC are nearly 1% off which was not the case with the XTEC and the 8.2 is now 8.3 and uh, this is more than a 1% off so I'm I think uh, the, the highest resistance range, uh, there's a measurement problem or an accuracy problem. And finally 10 MEC, there we are again on correct side with much less than 1%. So is this, this lo seems to be only in the between 5 MEC ohm and slightly below 10 MEC ohm. I find this a little bit strange uh, and um, perhaps somebody could comment if this is really a problem with the, with the measurement of how the measurement is done with the chipset inside the 121GW. So that was it for a strange behavior of the otherwise very good EV block multimeters. So thanks for watching. Until next time. Bye from Roger. Bye from Kanka Labs.